Hey friends, this is Reverend Jerry, the People's Priest, a.k.a. Father Jerry. And today I am coming to you with your Monday Musings. Recently, I was having a conversation with a friend of mine about some conflicts that they were having in their workplace. And as I was reflecting with them about this experience, one of the things that I found intriguing that came to mind in the conversation that we were having was the reality that I think so often we run metaphorically in our conversations to trying to come up with the idea the witty comment or whatever to be right in the conversation. You know, we might not necessarily want to be heard. We just want to be right. And I think because of that, we now have a culture that is uh, intrinsically arrogant, that is filled with people who rush to want to be right in every situation, um, do not spend much time trying to be heard or trying to hear what other people are trying to say. And I think the best cultural medicine for us today is to be people who run first to listen. The word listen in Latin is obadire, which is where we get the word obedience from in English. So to be an obedient person is to be a person who runs to listen. And what are you being obedient to? Well, you're being a rich, like, Primarily, you're being obedient to life because life is an ongoing process that unfolds. Um, We cannot rush life. Life happens at its own pace. And when we learn to make peace with that, we then have a habit of living where we find it much easier to extend grace to ourselves and to those who are around us. And if you wanted to visualize it a bit, you might see it as taking a big deep breath, sitting back on your chair, maybe crossing your legs and saying, this is okay. I don't need to rush to this. I can take a breath. I can take a moment. And I think if you do that, you discover what scripture says, let those who have ears or let those with ears, let them hear. And so if we utilize this cultural medicine of learning to listen as our first priority. It doesn't mean that we're not going to be right or that we're going to not get our point across. We can certainly get our point across and we can certainly express our conviction and our passion for whatever it is that we are discussing. But I think if we lead with the humility of being grounded in life, of consenting to the moment and allowing ourselves to listen, we discover not just spaces for us to put our points, but a spaciousness that allows us to be more gracious to those who are around us. And then in the end, in the long run, we will find that our life is happier, that we are healthier, that those around us are are more fulfilled, And all around, the quality of life increases. So running to listen first should be our main priority. So remember, dear friends, that life is short, and we do not have much time to gladden the hearts of those who journey with us. So be swift to love, make haste to be kind. And this day and every day, make sure to take your dose of cultural medicine by learning to run, to listen first. Monday Musings is a weekly reflection series brought to you by Reverend Jerry Maynard, the People's Priest, and produced by CNG Communications. For a small donation of $25 per month, you can be listed as a podcast sponsor. For more information, please visit revjerrymaynard.org and click on the People's Priest podcast under the media tab.